All right, everyone, we are here with Fox. Please raise your hand. Shotgun in. We'll start with you. Hey, Fox. Um, I know you guys uh, didn't really expect it first to Ben Simmons to be out. I was just curious how that may have affected your guys' uh, approach to tonight's game. Uh, I didn't. I mean, it's still, it's still a really good team. It's probably one of the, it's probably the deepest team in the NBA. So, I mean, I don't think it changed anything. James, yeah. Hey, De'Aaron, uh, Tyrese talked about you guys not having like an identity that you count on game in and game out. Is that something you feel that you guys just haven't really figured out what Kings basketball is this season for you? Uh, yeah, I think we've been uh, very inconsistent with uh, like how we've been. Um, Harrison talked about it and you know, saying, you know, we were kind of a, a different team tonight than we were, you know, Washington and, and Boston for sure. Um, and even even Charlotte, um, obviously, we just didn't finish that game well. Um, so we just we have to consistently just know how we're going to play and what we're going to do uh, night in and night out. Jason Jones. Hey, Aaron, just so much of your the team's identity in terms of in terms of pace is falls on you, it would seem. Do you feel like that's something that you can force more to get the team playing faster or is that a collective effort? Uh, yeah, for sure. Um, you know, I can do more with that. But uh, for us, you know, it's, it's hard to, you know, play at a fast pace if we're getting the ball out of the basket every time. So, um, you know, we have to be able to buckle down and get those and get stops. And that will definitely help us uh, with the pace of the game. Crystal Salters. Hello, Diaron. What was the biggest difference from last night uh, to tonight? And what would you like to improve to the game against the Cavaliers? I think we just came out flat. Um, you know, they hit us first and we just never really responded. So, um, yeah, I don't think we really gave ourselves a chance to win this game. And uh, this next game, come out the way we did, you know, yesterday. Um, you know, getting stopped, being able to execute offensively, not turning the ball over, things like that. Uh, and... You know, we, we let the chips fall where they may, and we give ourselves a chance to win. Jason Anderson. Hey, De'Aaron. Uh, uh, Thibel obviously has a great reputation as a as a defender. What what are the things he does that you know makes him so difficult on that end? I um, mean, he's tall, long. Um, you know, has great anticipation skills. Uh, you know, never gives up on a play. Plays hard. Uh, so, I mean, those those things you know help you uh, be a great defender, and it's something that he wants to do, knows he can do. And, you know, this is one of the best at it, so. Um, Sean Cunningham. Coming, coming off of last night, was this completely unexpected? Were you kind of worried that a game like this might exist, especially when they're with, down with so many players the way they are and they have different guys stepping up? Um, I mean, I don't, I don't think anybody would look at it like that. I mean, when guys were down last year, um, you know, Shake had a, a, a great stretch of, of games, and, you know, Tobias is obviously someone who, Definitely be you know an all star in this league. Uh, Dwight's Dwight still. Um, I mean they have they have guys all around that can play the game. So even with with guys out, they have you know people that'll step up. So uh, I would hope you know people weren't thinking that. Uh, James Ham. Darren, you mentioned Dwight there. Have you ever seen a player come out of a game with four goaltending calls? Uh, yeah, for sure. Definitely seen that happen in this league. 